What's up guys, Random Razor here with another review video for you guys today. And today we'll be taking a quick look at the Gus Buster Classic Umbrella. So of course without further ado, let's check out this umbrella, see what's so special about it, and give you guys my quick in-depth review. For those of you who are unfamiliar with the brand Gustbuster, Gustbuster is one of the first brands out there to attempt to revolutionize the umbrella, creating something that's unflippable, unflappable, and unleakable. Their classic umbrella is a 48 inch canopy design designed for looks as well as functionality. As you expect from any umbrella, Gustbuster does include a protective nylon sleeve for the umbrella. It also features a velcro strap to secure it in place. The handle of the umbrella is made of a natural classic curved wood handle, along with matching protective tips, as well as the stem. Keeping the canopy in place are two velcro straps along with the Gustbuster logo stitched on one of them. Continuing on with the top here, we do have a high impact end cap that helps protect the top of the umbrella in addition to a brass plate that holds the canopy on the top here together. Moving on to the interior of the umbrella here, it does feature an automatic open and a manual close. Underneath, we can see the most highlighted feature of the umbrella, the teardrop canopy design. How it works is pretty simple. Umbrellas flip over because there's too much air pressure underneath. When the wind pushes on it, it kind of acts as a sail, and to relieve that pressure, the umbrella will generally flip over. On the Gust Buster umbrellas, the raindrop holes underneath here relieve that pressure by allowing air to escape through. The second canopy on the top here ensures that you stay dry with elastic straps that flex in order to let the air out. In order to keep you dry, the raindrop holes are covered with a second canopy that is attached with elastic straps that are capable of flexing in order to release the air that's underneath and flow to the outside of the umbrella. It's a very effective and ingenious design that's simple and doesn't affect the overall look or functionality of an umbrella. Continuing on with the overview, the shaft of the umbrella is a double reinforced lightweight fiberglass that's lightning resistant because it's not made of metal, and also lighter weight so it'll be less strain on your arm. The ribs that hold the canopy up are also double reinforced fiberglass. Unlike steel blades, fiberglass ribs help eliminate crimping and snapping. Overall guys, the first impressions on the Gus Buster Classic Umbrella is very positive. I did pick up my own Gus Buster last year called the Metro Gus Buster and I reviewed that as well, and from my past year of using it, I definitely have to say the Gus Buster design is a proven design. Any umbrella can protect you from the rain, but the number one thing that a lot of people hate, of course, is when the wind gets it and flips it over. Thanks to this double canopy design, it really does make a difference and ensures that the umbrella doesn't flip over at all. The company has also tested out their umbrellas, maintaining that their umbrellas can hold their shape and not flip over in 55 plus mile per hour winds. Although I personally probably haven't been in a thunderstorm with 55 mile per hour winds as of yet with the Metro Umbrella, it definitely holds up in those type of storms from my past experience. In terms of the comments or changes I would make with the Umbrella, there really isn't anything bad to say about it. From my past experience with the Metro Umbrella, I haven't had any issues as of yet. But of course, one of the most important things is reliability and longevity. So we'll see how well this Umbrella lasts throughout the year and I'll definitely give you guys an updated review. The classic model is what I rate as an in-between umbrella, where it's not as big as a golf umbrella, so it's much more easier to carry around, but not as small as a portable umbrella, so you still get a nice large canopy. In conclusion guys, if you're looking to splurge some money on a very decent umbrella that's not going to flip on you anytime soon, you definitely can't go wrong with the Gus Buster Classic model. Anyways, thanks for watching guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and that's my quick in-depth review of the Gus Buster Classic model. As always, I'd like to thank Gus Buster for shooting this out for review, hit that like button, as always helps me out, and I'll see you all next video.